Hey guys, I'm Callie Lewis. And I am John P. And today, we are going to destroy this Apple MagSafe power adapter. Welcome to Geek TV. This episode of Geek TV is brought to you by Audible. So John, what are we gonna do today? All right, so we're gonna do a little bit of surgery on this MagSafe power adapter today. I can't believe you've destroyed the edge of your MacBook itself. Now you're gonna destroy the power that goes with it? That's what the is only up thing, with you? That's the only thing left to destroy. So here's why we're gonna do it. We got this awesome giant battery from Hyperjuice. Okay? I love these things. These are great. HyperMac makes some great batteries. I've used these in the past. I love them to take them with me when I travel. Yeah, so when they originally came out with these, mm -hmm. they had a cable that would plug right into the MagSafe dock on your Mac. Then Apple sued them. What's Apple, up, Apple? Apple doesn't like anybody use it. What's the What's the use of putting a proprietary plug-in <laughs> on your device if you don't let aftermarket people make something good to go with your device? That's just stupid, <laughs> Apple. Anyway. Rant so, over. So I'll tell you what. Hyperjuice is what they're doing now is they're yes. still selling the batteries, but now what they're doing is selling a little kit that you can use. It's like a little DIY kit. Make your own. Exactly. Okay, now here's the deal. If you don't want to do what we're about to do, what you can do is... They have a little adapter that plugs into this that looks like a cigarette lighter uh -huh. jack. And you can buy the Apple Airline Travel Adapter right. to plug in between this and this. Correct. But there's a catch. Sometimes it doesn't work. Or if you have a 17-inch MacBook, it draws too much power. Well, e yeah, even, even worse than all that, what will happen is if, if it is working, right. it will only power the device. It will not charge the internal battery. Right. Okay, something about using that cable. So you've got cable. use while you're using it, but yep. outside of that, no, yeah. no go. Plus, you've got to have all these extra cables, and we're not about all the extra cables. So, first thing we're going to do is we're going to crack this puppy open. We're going to make it so that one end of this device can be used to power this okay. off of the original Mac power adapter. Right. And we're going to make it so that the other end connects to the MagSafe cable and we can go directly from this from to this. To here. Okay? okay, are you ready? I am ready. Okay, you're gonna cut the cord. I am not cutting a cord with a pair of scissors, John. Okay, fine. That's ridiculous. Okay, you're gonna cut the cord. You can use those. You ready? When you're in need of a big battery like the Hyperjuice, you're most likely traveling or out and about doing something, right? Just imagine if you could easily lose yourself in a good novel while on a road trip. It would go by so much faster. Audible helps you do just that with over 100,000 titles to choose from. Download them and listen to them anywhere, anytime. At Abelboa3 on Twitter says Ender's Game is amazing. I want to hear what you think is the perfect way to spend your time. Go get your free audiobook at Audible Podcast com slash geekbeat. You can use those. You ready? Why can't I use those? Because those are too dangerous for you. For a girl? No, Is that what you were that. about to say? I, I say think that. he was about to say for a girl. Hey, would you cut this right Where, about right here? here? Yeah, that's, that's good. Don't cut my finger. All the way through? Do it. That's what the definition of cut is. Yes. Oh, I screwed it up. You, <laughs> you just destroyed that thing. Yes! Okay. I love destroying things. Now, here's what we're going to do. These are wire strippers. Do you know how to use wire strippers? I have never used a pair. I've seen it done, here's but I've never the, used one. Now, hold that in your hand. Ah, you, you got me. Now, there's a lot of little teeth here. What we're going to do is we're going to stick this in the biggest one. Okay. And we're looking to strip about three quarters of an inch off the end. So now, go ahead and squeeze it slowly so you don't get my finger. Go ahead. Now, go ahead and squeeze it all the way. Squeeze, squeeze hard. There you oh, go. Oh, so it okay, all, now let go, automatically let go. does it. Now, yeah. You, Did I squeeze too hard? No, that's okay. So we got a few shavings. That's okay. Now what we're going to do is we're going to kind of unravel this. This uh, this silver wire here is actually the negative. Okay. It's the negative part of the cable. Okay. And so you so unravel just, that. Yeah. Get gonna, it away from the uh, the inside cable. The inside part. Yeah. We're going to get it all kind of away from there. Okay. And then what we're going to do is twist that together so that it's essentially one ah uh. that that's one cable. That's our negative wire, okay? That's now, easy to do. Now we need to strip the other we need to strip this I off. Get to use these again? You do. Watch right. my finger. Upside down, right? Okay. Here we go. Now this one we're going to use a slightly smaller 
uh, set right right about there slowly slowly okay now go for it squeeze there you go so you stripped okay if you do it right now I'm learning it just kind of pops the end off that's right so you strip the end right off that okay so that's so our, now we have more that's our positive that's our negative now we want to make sure they're roughly the same length they're pretty good okay. that's fine now what we're gonna do is this this particular adapter has a little cover we're gonna pop the cover off there we go now you'll notice there are two right quick connects okay if you pull these back you'll, you'll notice they're kind of springy you can pull them back okay so this they're, they're marked positive and negative and what we're gonna do is we're gonna plug the positive cable we're gonna, That's the inside one, the last one that you did. Right. We're gonna we're gonna slide the little adapter back and shove this all the way in there. Okay. Way on in there. Now it's 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 snug. It's tight. Doesn't want to come out. Now we're gonna do the same thing with the negative one. And the negative is the first one that you did and and wrapped away from the inside That's cable. That's right. And this one this is this is a little tricky when you. Yeah, you kind of uh, have to maneuver. You know what it, I'm right? gonna do is I'm gonna do them both at the same time, so that uh, I don't have to kind of do them. I don't have to try and do it one after the other. All right. Okay. And it's important for them all to be together, correct? Otherwise, what happens? Well, you want to keep as much of the cable in there as possible so that when it gets seated in there, um, uh, you, you've got good contact. That is it. Okay. That's it. That's it. All right. Now, so we place this. Yeah. We're going to shove this down a little bit. We're going to put the cap on here. And snap it back together. Now, if we did it right. Uh-oh, the question is, did we do it if right? We did it or right. did I screw it up? <laughs> no, if we did it right, we can plug this in right. to the MagSafe adapter. Plugged. And we can plug this in to the charging port. And we get, and we get a little green power uh, LED right there. So the green power tells you you did it right. We should be in, Go John. We should be in business. Yes. So that what is next? how we do that. Now, this, this particular cable is done, okay. and we want to get that out of the way. But what we want to do is be able to make this cable, to make this power brick charge our battery. So guess what? what? We're going to do the exact same thing. We're just going to do it with the other cable. OK. So first thing is we need about 3 quarters off the end of this. Uh, that should be about right good here. right there. Slowly, now, slowly, slowly. Slowly, slowly. And give it a go. There you go. There we good. go. Again, just popped off. That's right. Now we're gonna kind of okay. Gonna separate it again. This is the negative. Yep. We're gonna get those cables unraveled. Cue the music. Do 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 do. Or and not my music. Right. <laughs> okay. Now we've got our negative one. Now wire strippers. All right. Wire strippers again. Now we're using the slightly smaller hole. And, and how do you determine which about, hole you want? Well, just, based just on something that's a little bit bigger than the internal wiring. Right here. There you go. Now do it. There you go. Now we've got that one. I'm getting good at this. You are. See, you guys, things that are like this, maybe many of you might feel a little uh, intimidated by or scared of doing because you might hurt it. When you, you know, you watch something like this, you understand how to do it, then go at it. Go after it because... I'm going to bet most likely you're not going to do it wrong. You're just going to get it right. And then you're going to feel Great. empowered, empowered to do more. That's it. Okay. We're done. How do we know we did it right this time? Well, we plug it into the wall and see if we've got power. Perfect. And that's it. We should be able to now plug this charger into the battery here. Uh, oops, right there. Okay. <laughs> and then we'll plug this one right. in over here. Over here. And voila, you're done. Perfect. So this is from five minute modification. The the actual kit the actual kit costs about fifty bucks in addition to okay. the battery because not everyone needs it. You can use these batteries for all kinds of other devices. Right. But uh, if you want to do it, that's one very very easy way to now be able to take your MacBook on the on the road with the battery, one cable, you're done. And thank if you, you thank you, and if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up on YouTube. And uh, if you're not subscribed yet, go to youtube.com forward slash geekbeat TV. Thanks for joining us, guys. I'm Callie Lewis. I'm John P. Bye bye. bye. My bruise is going away a little. 
Should I poke at him and make it worse? I mean, I think I beat myself up in the middle of the night. Like, mm. <laughs> uh.